EA Sports, it's in the game. Great play call, great pass, great reception. That play, not at all.
It's the National Football League on EA Sports. And if it's in the game, it's in the game. It's the Buccaneers and the Cowboys under the lights on Sunday night. We are sandwiched between Fort Worth and Dallas, Texas and Arlington at the luxurious AT&T Stadium. Tonight, it's the Sunday night opener for the new NFL season between the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and the Dallas Cowboys. With my good friend Charles Davis in the booth, I'm Brandon Gauden, and the moment has finally arrived. See Brandon Gordon alongside the one and only Charles Davis and CD. Lots of compelling storylines in a game like this. Let's take a look at some of the numbers for these two offenses. And I'm glad you brought up the numbers because sometimes it's hard to quantify a team's performance solely by judging the numbers. But I think with these two teams, what you see is a pretty accurate representation of who they are. It's the marquee game of opening weekend, and off we go on a Sunday night on EA Sports. From the six. And he returns this to the 22. So here are the Cowboys now, ready to go on offense for the first time. And they'll be let out by their six-year quarterback. I tell you what, when he is on schedule for that week, secondaries take notice because you've got to stay alert back there on every snap. A truly powerful arm, one that's capable of challenging any level of the defense on any given play. That's why so many scouts preach arm talent when preparing for the NFL draft. A quarterback with arm strength to make every throw in the book, he's an asset to have in any offense. They'll run with Freeman here to begin the drive. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. After the loss to start out, here's second and 11. Bradford now. Into a double team, and it's intercepted. And the Bucs are going to take possession of the football. Brandon, I wonder if someone's down there checking on the head coach right now because he might be in a little bit of shock after what just transpired. Instead of a lengthy opening drive to deal with, his guy stepped up and stole that drive away. Momentum on their side now. How will they attack on offense? So the Bucks now in great shape to begin their initial possession. And they will be let out by a young man making his first NFL start. Okay. Right. 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 This is Hillman on first and ten. It'll be a pickup of 10 yards. And it'll be second and very short. Ready? Hillman again. And he's able to work it here to the eight-yard line. It's a three-yard pickup, and that sets up a first and goal. A chance for their first points of the season here is it's first and goal. To throw Mariota. And he's going to be dropped back at the 15-yard line. First down, a bit of a disaster, and now on second and goal, back even further. To throw is Mariota. And he takes a shot on the release, as this will be incomplete. They're bringing a lot of pressure here already in the first quarter. Already sacked him once. Now they get in there and knock another one away. You think maybe that tuck rule being gone makes defenses a lot bolder? Yes, indeed. That time, lucky that the arm was going forward. Incomplete pass. And he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. A very costly sack there on third and goal. Pushes him back big time. And now you figure the field goal team coming on on fourth. And this one is right down Broadway. And the Bucks take a 3-0 lead. So the opening drive stalls out, but the field goal does get them the first points of the night. And three points not to be underestimated. How about... Trying to shake off the interception, he'll look to throw. He sets to fire deep, and that will be incomplete. Would have been a big hitter if they had connected. Instead, it's second down. To throw on second and ten. And this is Floyd, complete. 
And he's going to be dropped following a pickup of seven past the 30 to the 32. Third and short yardage, Bradford. Over the middle, complete. That's Freeman. And he will have a Cowboys first down, I do believe. Yes, he's got it by about a yard there on third and three. A lot of hype, of course, going into this one with the Cowboys and the Bucks. They met last year in the season opener. Remember, that was the night they raised the banner in Tampa. It was also Dak Prescott's comeback game. And the Bucs wound up winning 31-29 on a late Ryan Suckup field goal. Really good game that was. But these two teams were also the two best offenses in the NFL last year. The Cowboys gaining 18 more yards over the course of the season than the number two Bucks. A good run got seven on first. Here's second and three. From the gun, it's a run for Freeman. And this one not going anywhere. They get him at the 44 for a gain of just a yard. Just not a whole lot of room to operate okay, there on that carry. No, not at all. They did a really nice job staying in their proper places and not allowing any lanes to open up. Got his man complete over the middle. That's Thomas. And this is going to lead to another first down as the tackle's made at the Bucks' 44-yard line. The drive stays intact with a pickup of 13. We often hear the phrase sure-handed tight ends, and he certainly fits into that category. Plus, he's got a quarterback who knows to look his way when they need a big pickup. And on this play, he finds it for the first down. So from Buccaneer territory now, it's first and 10 at the 44-yard line. Freeman with a fast feed and a good push up front and he's able to navigate his way down inside the 30. 15 more there and they're on a roll. It's another first down. Here's Bradford. This is complete to Watkins on the slam. And he's going to be brought down at about the 16. Well, coaches always talk about finding balance on offense. I don't think you can get much more balance than this. Big time run, big time pass. A one-two combination. Looked pretty good. How about that? They, they, let's, see if they, let's see if they can continue to take that kind of a punch, though. And this is intercepted, but they'll say out of bounds. So very close to a turnover there in the end zone. Throwing again on second and ten. Bradford over the middle. He's got Watkins. Nine yards, not quite enough, and they'll be left now with third and one. So they just need one yard here to pick up the first down. On third and one, here's Bradford. And down he goes. Pressure gets him back at the 14. A well-designed. Ready, break. They'll run with Hillman here to begin the drive. And he will lose yardage here back at the 23-yard line. So the opening play of the drive goes backwards. Now they'll come up on second and 12. And he'll get it up near the 35, right at the 34 here. They get 11 back on that one. It leads to third Ready. down. Heavy set out there on third and one. Ready? They'll try and run for the first with Hillman. And he'll lose yardage. Brought down at the 32. Second quarter now, and it's Buccaneer football. Here we go, set. Clock, 10, 10. Mario to the throw for it on fourth. Thomas has got it, complete. And he is going to have Jack the Rex, Buccaneers Jack first Rex. down as they manage to convert. Jack and that'll keep the drive alive. Eluding the pressure right. And he whips that one incomplete there. Well, that's a defensive coordinator's got to be Ready, happy with that result. They took away all options downfield and forced the incompletion. They go play action. Mariota escaping the pressure right. And he can't. He's taken.
second down. So, Charles, no turnovers yet for this offense, but those sacks now, they're starting to pile up. And one thing go. usually leads go. to another because they've got to figure out how the offensive line hey. and everyone else involved in protection can keep their quarterback upright and allow him a chance to throw the ball downfield. Touchdown! Oh, a great effort there. 68 yards. Bradford on first down. They'll set up the screen for Freeman. And he'll be upended at the 28-yard line. Just a three-yard gain there. Here's second and seven now from the 28. Bradford to throw it. And it's incomplete. We've already seen him catch a few passes out of the backfield in the first half, unable to connect on that one. Certainly seems like getting him the ball out of the passing game, though, is part of their game plan. It certainly is because he catches it well, creates a mismatch. You're going to cover him with a linebacker, a corner, a safety. They feel like he can win every battle. On the ready. Drill, 52. Ready, ready. They'll start out on the ground with a Jai. And he's going to take this ahead for right around three yards, but no more than that. Second down. Let's go now. Three yards on that last carry. Here's second and seven. Ready. Now Mariota. He gets it to Thomas. And down he goes, but he takes it up to the 40. He is putting on a show in this second quarter, racking up the receiving down. yards as he has a first down. Now it's a giant. And he's got room. That's a good acceleration there as he's across midfield to the 48-yard line. They stay on the ground. Again, it's a giant. And some solid footwork there as he'll take this down to about the 38. They get 10 more there, and I believe that will be enough for another first Fire, down. It will. Faster, faster. This is a Johnny. And tough sledding. He'll get maybe a yard. Stop short of the 35. Yeah, things were pretty stacked up there in the middle of the line. A lot of bodies, not much space. I think ultimately he was fortunate to get anything out of that run. And he'll get three down to the 34-yard line. I okay, do know ready? from experience that when you slow down someone's running game, you're now doing the dictating on defense. And guess what? Now you're getting ready to tee off on their quarterback because they have to throw it all the time. But you still have to be alert for the draws and other plays of that nature to make sure you don't get hurt. And down he goes, taking it inside the, the 10, just shy of the 5 at the 6. Dang. And he's going to be met at the line of scrimmage and taken down. On the set. No gain on the play that time, and it sets up second and goal. 43 rail. Cut, cut. They run with a giant. And he's into the end zone for the Tampa Bay touchdown. Bradford now to throw on first down. That is incomplete. A misconnection there. He's hit on just 50% of his passes thus far. That's not where you want to be. Now you see the evolution of the game. You go back to the quarterbacks of old. 50% would be terrific because they threw the ball downfield almost every time they throw it. Now with the short passing game, you should be above 60% just to be in the average range. Give him 10 there, good enough for a Cowboy first down. Two minutes remaining in this first half of football. Coming in, he really liked his chance of having a big year based on a terrific offseason. And runs like that on opening weekend, show that he's right. The first down throw for Bradford. Caught by Wilson. And they're going to get this up to midfield. First down. Clock rolling. Bradford now from the 50. And that is incomplete. Now the coverage a little too good there. And it's second down. 
An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and ten. Now Bradford. That one thrown away from the pocket. The officials kind of looking at each other, but they'll say there was a receiver go, in the go. area, so no penalty, just an incomplete pass. On third down, Bradford. And a completion to Wilson. And a nice job there defensively. They get him to the ground short of the first, right around the 42. Out now comes the Cowboys punter as he'll punt it away for the second time. And now a low liner. I think he mishit him. And this will be down by a member of the kicking team just outside of the 30-yard line. Well, the Bucks going to take over now late in this first half. And with a two-score lead already, they may just have to get this thing to the locker room. From the 32 now, here's first and 10. Mariota to throw it. Open man downfield is Sanders. He's got him. Touchdown, Tampa Bay. A big play there. First down, Bradford. And Thomas has it. The completion, but they go in the wrong direction. A loss of yards, and now they're dealing with a second and long. 60 bison, 60 bison. To throw is Bradford. And that is incomplete. And attempted a deep ball there, they didn't get it. But boy, they're gonna need a few of those to actually hit in order to get back into this game. Good thing they do have a little bit of time here still left in the contest. Decent sized deficit, but not one that they can't manage. Ready, set! First down, Mariota. This is caught by Evans. And all the way inside the 15 before they drop him. Now a timeout taken. Perhaps a chance for one more quick play and then another timeout if they hurry. We'll see. Flush to his right. And oh, it'll be intercepted. And he will be out of bounds with no time remaining on what will be the final action of this first half. All right, we will save the week one highlights and apparently get right back to the action here in the third. Welcome back, halftime. Let's go, baby. Let's have some fun. Come on, set. Striker, three, three. Set, cut. They'll begin the drive with a Jai. And he can only manage to get a couple. Second and eight coming up. They'll break the huddle. Come up on second and eight at the 27-yard line. Great. Mariota now. And too much juice. It'll be out of bounds incomplete. Ready. So the failure to connect on second down, that leaves him staring up here at a third and eight. Up the middle, Hilbert. And he's going to come up a bit short. He needed to get Let's to the 35 for the first, but he only makes it to the 34. Now Mariota on fourth down. And it's incomplete. They cannot convert, and they turn it over. So certainly an interesting call there to go for it. And Dallas, they'll take over in terrific field position. And they'll begin by running the option. And this play will be blown up. He'll lose yardage back at the 38. Well, the first play of the drive lost four. Now they'll look to move it forward here on second and 14. Now Bradford. Looking for Floyd, and it's intercepted. Well, still down quite a bit here, several scores. Ready. But, yeah, at least that's a start, Charles, getting the interception here. And look, we're still in the third quarter, so this thing not done yet. You're right about that, Brandon. This defense, they haven't quit on this game. They stayed with it and got an interception and handed the ball back to their here offense. And what you wonder about 
is a team that just threw that interception. They've got to be careful about developing a sense of complacency and thinking this game is over. And he'll take this up near the 35, maybe the 34. It'll be a gain of five, but still about three yards shy of the first down marker, and now it's third down. Yeah, that one's going to be knocked away and incomplete. Quarterbacks work all the time on manipulating the defense go. with Here their eyes go. and their head movement. In this case, he just stared the receiver down. That allowed for excellent Set. coverage, able to knock that one away. Ebron caught left side. And he's going to have the Bucks first down as they manage to convert. And that'll keep the drive alive. What a time for his first catch as they get the conversion on fourth. Let's go now. Altogether, a pretty shaky start to the year for this defense as they defend another first and ten. Here's a giant. And not a whole lot of room to operate there on the first down run. He gets maybe three. Down. The last run got three. Now here's second and seven. 22 needle. Ready? And he'll push this forward only to about the 42-yard line. Here we go. Seventh play of the drive upcoming here on third and six. Set. To throw is Mariota. Flushed out right. And he's going to hook up with his big tight end. Complete. And he's able to get this one out closer to midfield across the 45. Let's go. Two first downs have him up near midfield now on first and ten. Set. Go. One back in the backfield, he'll get the carry. And a strong run there as he'll take this all the way down to the 35. So first and 10, and if they score on this drive, might have to start digging in our second half blowout material. And yeah, this will be a gain of five as he gets it to the 30. Ready, ready. Fight, 97, ready. From the 30 on second down, Mariota drops it off for Hillman. And he's going to get this down near the 25. Strike it, strike it. And they're going to hurry back to the line ready, now. Ready. Out of the gun, the give to Hilbert. And he gets the first down here as he's taken down at the 24. Well, this has been a long drive. In fact, it's eaten up a good chunk of the third quarter, which is precisely what you want when you're playing with the lead. You control the football, you control the clock, you can impose your will on the defense. Here's a throw to his running back. It's complete. And he'll be marked down right at the 20-yard line. Let's go, Throwing again on second down. Mariota over the middle. It's Thomas. And they're going to be set up now with the ball at the 13-yard line. From the 13 now, they work on first and 10. Here's Mariota. Quickly, but it's incomplete. Well, they certainly did a nice job there picking him up out of the backfield and then running stride for stride with him. That's good coverage, and it led to an incompletion. The second down throw here for Mariota. Try. But this is intercepted. And the Cowboys are going to take possession here at their own six yard line. Six the Eagles. Six the Eagles. Check, Panther. They'll try to get the ground game going with Freeman. It's a pickup of four, and it'll bring up second down. Freeman again. And not much there at all, as he'll get this only up to about the 11. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. Bradford. Oh, look at Thomas wide open. And he will be taken down, but a big pickup there on what's going to be the final play of the third quarter. One quarter remains here on a Sunday night. We'll return with more after this break. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. And now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. They lead big, and a major part of that has been how they've taken their play to a whole new level this second half. No points allowed since the break. And you can add another incompletion to the total number that they forced in this runaway contest. And this is going to lead to another first down as the tackle's made at the Bucks 40. 23 yards to pick up there. So from Buccaneer territory now, it's first and 10 right at the 40. A throw there, but that's going to wind up incomplete. 
Let's go. So second down and 10. Once again, they'll go from the 40. They'll throw again. Bradford. Wide open receiver complete. And this is going to lead to another first down as the tackle's made at the Bucks' 25-yard line. To throw, Bradford. He gets it to Thomas. Touchdown, Cowboys! 25 yards for the touchdown. Ready up? Watch out now. 50 Fury. Hunt. They'll start on the ground here on first down. And he's going to get a solid gain of nine before Hunt being brought Hunt down. Hunt second and right at a yard. Set. From the 36, Mariota. His throw incomplete. That incompletion certainly makes this upcoming third down a little Set. bit Hunt. more crucial. They need to find the right play to convert here and maybe start to tamp punch, down punch. a little bit of momentum. The other side is starting to gain. And getting this just shy of midfield, they'll spot it at the 49. The defense surrenders a 13-yard pass play there Ready. on third and one. So signs of life in what's been a dormant offense in this second Ready. half. Here's first and 10. Tough to imagine any team wanting to give a player like this up in a trade, but I know they're happy to have it. It is amazing, isn't it? But we have seen big-time guys change teams. Jimmy Graham, Brandon Marshall, and their new teams are really excited to have them because they provide big-time targets. Turns out to be a great idea to top that one. Go for 24 yards. Mariota now to throw on first down. Over the middle, and it's incomplete. Well, it looked like a march to the end zone. He's hit a momentary roadblock with that incompletion. No need to panic. They just got to come up with a high percentage play call and see if they can get their offense back on track. Now a man open down the middle of the field. And they're going to get this down to about the 17-yard here line here. here. The offense on third down tonight, five out of nine thus far. Ready. They're up against a third and one situation. And he'll be out of bounds about a half to a full yard shy of the five. Nothing open downfield. He keeps it himself for 11 and a first down. A good chance now to put this game on ice. This is first and goal. Mariota. And he hauls it in for the Buccaneer touchdown. A great... Hold it ready. Cougar 19. On first and 10, Bradford. Thomas has got it, complete. Finding space at the 40. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. One play has him up past the 40 already, and another first and 10. Bradford now. And this is Floyd, complete. And he'll be brought down inside the 40-yard line. So from Buccaneer territory now, it's first and 10 at the 39-yard line. Here's Bradford. And that is incomplete. Oh, my goodness. He was in his own zip code, but somehow could not look it in. Again, it's Bradford. Wilson's got it complete. And he's going to be taken down at about the 33. In search of four yards here to pick up the first down. There's Bradford. There's a short little toss to Carrier. And down to the 20 he'll go before heading out of bounds. This is Freeman on first and 10. And this one goes nowhere. Losing yardage back at the 22. Two yards the loss, second and 12. From the shotgun, it's Bradford. And a completion to Wilson. 
And he's gonna be marked down oh. just outside the 10. Just two minutes remaining here in the fourth quarter of what has been a one-sided affair. This will be play number eight here on the drive. It's third and a yard. Now Bradford. And that is incomplete. And that's another play that's painted the picture of this game overall. It's been a blowout. It's been continually fueled by big turnovers and stops for one side and an inability to advance the ball from the other. Let's and go, he will go, have the go. first down inside the hey, 10 to hey. the nine yard line. Being chased out left. And he'll just throw this one over in the way of the security crew, incomplete here. Another shot from the nine on second and goal. Bradford. And that is incomplete. A lot of force bearing down on him there. He could not hang on, it's third down. Third and goal, Bradford. To the end zone, but it's incomplete. At this point in the game, they've got to continue to try anything they can. They're still working at it, even though this one feels like a lost cause. Desperation time. Bradford on fourth down. And this is going to be intercepted. And the Buccaneers are going to take possession here. It's a touchback, and they'll take over at the 20-yard line. Well, I mean, field goals probably aren't going to cut it at this point. This was touchdown or bust, and unfortunately for them, it turned out to be bust. Yeah, they're feeling like they've got to force the issue here, maybe take some chances they wouldn't have earlier in the game. Damn. But give credit to this defense. They've really stood tall throughout, and they come up with the interception in the end zone. They'll start this drive out on the ground. And he's going to take this ahead for right around three yards, but no more than that. Second down. Here we go. Now second and seven from the 23. Back to the ground. This time it's Hillman. Looking to find a lane, but he can't. Reined in at the line of scrimmage. Let's go. So seven yards from the first down here as they come up to the line of scrimmage. <laughs> On third down, they're going to run for it here. There's the stiff arm. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. Now the Bucks going to use the first That's of their ready. timeouts. It's just their first. They've got two more to use here Touch. in the final stages. They run again with a Jai. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. Now another timeout called for by the offense. That'll leave him with just one remaining in this fourth quarter of play. And he's got this one across midfield into Cowboy territory. Now the offense will burn their third and final timeout. And as the two teams talk it over on their respective sidelines, we take a break. They try to throw on second down, but this one is incomplete. Well, their passing attack, even though that one was incomplete, has been really sharp in this one. It's resulted in a lot of touchdowns, and it looks like they're not going to stop throwing the football until the very end of this one. Well, that will certainly make everyone involved on offense pretty happy. Because He's got a man complete, and he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two shot of the 10. But well, partner, that'll do it. These week one primetime games, they all...